All right, so I'm gonna try out this bad boy for today. I'm pretty excited. impression I like it I uh, went around the curves there didn't scout uh, I'm not sure what those I don't know it looks the stripe looks a little different but uh, I think it's cutting really well what do you think I think so I think once you try striping it <clears throat> a couple times it'll look pretty good because you're used to the back being flat with two wheels yeah you got one. Is that, is that the difference, you think? Yep. Yeah, I think you're probably right. It almost looks like the walker yeah. going down. But, I mean, that's the first time you cut it with that. So, well, I'm going to go mow with this thing. I'm going to mow this back here, and uh, I'll give you a little bit better review here in a little bit. So what do you think about it? A little bouncy. <laughs> Other than that, I love it. I think it's going to be a great machine if I can get it at a good deal. Good price anyway. So, let me know what you guys would pay for it. It's got 1,300 hours on it. It's a 60 inch turf tracer, 20 horse Kohler Command. Uh, X series. Don't know what that means, but. Let me know what you get for it used. I wanted to share a story with you guys. Uh, we're just we were mowing the property. Jesse brought his right stander because he's trying to sell it, and a guy was going to meet him over there and look at it and whatnot. So anyway, they're over there, they're messing around. You know, the guy's looking at the mower and all that stuff. And then uh, I go over there, and uh, Jesse Jesse said that the uh, the guy was doing some research on the right stander. And came across my video where I said it had the scalping problem all in, and all that stuff. So the guy looks at me and he goes, so honestly, if I don't buy it, it's probably going to be your fault. Because <laughs> I, I made that review. Uh, too funny.
so I'm putting together my video, uh, my review of this 60 inch turf tracer, and uh, I realized that I really didn't give it a review. Uh, so I mowed with it all day. Uh, they let me mow with it all day. I'm gonna take it back tomorrow morning. And you know, I gotta say, I like it. I like it. Uh, it did scalp a little bit, but I've come to kind of kind of believe that any 60 inch mower is gonna scalp a little bit. Uh, I was talking to Jesse about this and I think, you know, the more we used it, the more we would figure out, you know, where it's gonna scalp because you know when you've been using a 48 for a long time you know where the dips are you know when you're using the 48 but when now now you go to a 60 you know you have you have different different problem areas now i believe so uh but all in all i, I thought it did really well i thought it did better than the right standard a lot better than the right standard uh you know i thought the cut was excellent and uh you know this this it has a mulch kit on it they, they have the baffle underneath there and then they have the uh, the the hole covered up so uh, it's got the mulch kit on and I'm not sure I like that I, I really we wasn't cutting that tall that thick of grass and uh, it was leaving clumps so uh, if I do buy this machine I'll probably be taking that off and just have a side discharge with maybe a grass flap or something uh, but not sure I'm gonna buy it yet. Uh, I think they're wanting a little bit too much for it. And uh, it is a, uh, I'm not even sure what year it is, but it's got almost 1400 hours on it. Uh, but I think it runs really strong. I don't know what I'm gonna do yet, uh, but I do like it, I really do.